Well, Eyewitness News reporter Tommy Noel got a lot of requests for today's edition of Does It Really Work? The chef basket starts off flat, but will expand to let you cook, boil, or even deep fry your food. Let's find out how it rates on the speedometer. Introducing the Chef Basket, the new cooking dynamo that transforms itself for dozens of everyday uses. This chef, Shanna Hill, will find out if the Chef Basket lives up to the claims. Shanna makes cupcakes at the cocoa bean, but for this test, we'll stick with foods that cook on the stove. First up, pasta. You simply put in your pasta and put it in the pot. Sounds easy enough, and it is. According to the directions, the handles must extend horizontally outside the pot. This was an issue, so Shanna got it in the right spot, then had to add more water. Another issue we found. Oh. The basket fell into the pot a couple times. If it's off center, it's going to fall in. You'll just have to find that perfect spot for the basket to sit. Now for the transfer test. From the pot to the plate, no issues. Tastes good, too. Yeah. Just stay away from the small elbow macaroni. It won't work for small pasta because of the holes in it. Next, using the hot water from the pasta, we'll boil up some potatoes. Just like the pasta, potatoes popped out with no problems. But it's easy to pull them out. Flip the chef basket over, and it becomes a steamer. We cooked up some carrots, and again, no issues with the transferring. The nice thing is, Shannon never burned herself. The handles stay cool. Besides the basket being a little unsturdy, Shannon gives it her seal of approval. I think overall, um, it was pretty good. The infomercial was pretty right on. Turning to the spudometer, we'll give it four spuds. I knew there was a reason we boiled potatoes. You can get the chef basket at Walgreens for 15 bucks. Reporting in Rexburg, I'm Tommy Noel. I think that's the first time he's ever actually had spuds for the spudometer. For that, then that is the best rating we've had. Yeah, okay. Yes. Well, there it is. Seems flimsy, but it yeah, worked. But you know, you can't argue with it. I I've got it set up here like this, and I put my you know, and yeah. it's very know, nice. Not bad. And like you said, you don't get burned. No, I'm all for that. All right, clever. What if you could use it for a frisbee? If you no, probably. <laughs> all right, stay there. We're back with another look at your. Board.